Hola, clase. A um, couple more minutes till we start here. Just gonna get things adjusted a little bit on my end. As we all make our way into class, hope everyone's week's going well. Oh. Yeah, recording. We're recording this uh, a little bit earlier than usual. So please excuse the attire. I also decided that since I was going to be dressed a little different, I might as well put on my other headphones. So usually I always go with these uh, Apple headphones. I personally like these a lot. I think they're also like iconic <laughs> um, for just podcasting, but or for just like YouTube commentary and whatnot. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and give those a break today, so they will be back. Don't worry. It's almost three o'clock, and we'll get started here. If you're on Twitch, I appreciate you watching over there. If you're on YouTube, I appreciate that. If you're on any other alternative platforms. Oh, sorry. If you're on any other alternative platforms, I appreciate you joining us there. It's just about 3 p.m. And once we get started, or once it gets to 3 p.m., we'll go ahead and get started. All right, well, let's go ahead and begin, 3 p.m. Central Standard Time. So if you were here yesterday, we were going through some of these um, lessons here and where we're at now. Let me see if I'm switching this. Perfect. Okay. So where we are now. Let's see. And. Oh, nice. I did finish unit nine last night. I wasn't sure. I couldn't remember if I did or didn't. But for those that weren't aware, it was a little difficult to close unit nine. Um, I had that little bit of trouble with that last lesson. But we're going to get. Actually. Let me just. Oh, shoot going to review I wonder if I can just review ¿Dónde está tu novia? Bea está en el aeropuerto So if you don't know Spanish too well this is a great time to jump on in ¿Dónde está tu novia? Bea está en el aeropuerto Ella habla con el hombre del mostrador Ella habla con el hombre del mastador. So, where is your girlfriend? Bea is in the airport. She is speaking with the man. Hola. ¿Necesitas ayuda? Sí. Voy para Barcelona. Uh, hello. Do you need help? Yes. Y quisiera estar al lado de mi novia en el avión. Bring my boyfriend on the plane. Plane is avión. Está bien. Tenemos dos asientos juntos. And I know that I'm going to probably mispronounce some of these words or I might even get them wrong while we're going through the story. So if there's anything I get wrong that I don't notice I got wrong, let me know in the comment section down below. I appreciate that. Está bien. Uh, tenemos dos uh, Santiago juntos. Perfecto. Perfecto. The wise beta happy. There are two seats available together. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, juntos is together. Seats, yep. There are two seats available. Mm, ¿Dónde está tu novia? Mm, where is your no sé. I'm, ¿Puede ayudarme know. a buscarla? ¿Cómo es? Mm, ella es alta. Tiene el pelo negro. She is tall. El pelo negro. Está bien. Le gusta hacer deportes y bailar. Ah... Uh. A ella le encantan los animales, pero come demasiado chocolate. Está bien. 
¿Cómo se llama tu novia? ¿Ah? Yo no sé. ¿No sabes cómo se llama tu novia? You do not know your boyfriend's name? That's strange. Bea doesn't know her own. It's her girlfriend's name. So, it's actually, this is, I saw someone saying the other day that Duolingo had, was supporting, uh, like it was being inclusive by having lessons like no this. No tengo novia todavía. I don't mind it, but. ¿Puede ayudarme a buscar una? It's a little una? confusing sometimes. Uh, yo no tengo novia todavía, puedo ayudar a una. Did you get that, Bea? Doesn't have a girlfriend yet? You're wasting this guy's time. Uh, donde seats asintios together juntos? Do you need help? Necesitas ayudas? Sports deportes. All right. So we'll see what that came out. We're just going straight into the level up. That was silly. Because we can handle it. Yo estoy bien, estoy. gracias. ¿Y tu esposa cómo está? Está. Hasta luego, señor Perez. Tienes... Tienes un peculo favorito, favorita, favorita, y un sándwich favorito, favorito. El hombre es de China, o China. Hola, cómo estás? estás. Yo estoy bien, estoy. gracias. Carmen es de mexicano, mexicana. Oh, Carmen es de México. I don't know why I didn't know that off the top of my head. It's important to slow down sometimes because it's always easy to avoid simple and stupid mistakes like that one. Alberto is de Mexico y Camila is de Cuba. El, el es Mexico, el. Mexicano. Ella, Ella is Cubana. Yo soy de China. Carmen is de Mexico. Okay, perfect. La fiesta is divertida. 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 La fiesta is divertida. El concierto is divertido. 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 I need to work my pronunciations in that. Uh, Quan Quan Win. I think wonders how many. I think it's qual es el concierto. Cuando I. Sorry. It's all good. It's all good. But that just goes to show you a lot of times when you think you know the answer first off, just go with your first thought. All right, that's near. Señor, estás. Estás. Usted cansado y tu Andrea está bien. Está. Uh, I've been getting a little tricked up on these because usually I think estás would be the well, it's a plural, but I would think it'd be under usted. I knew it. I don't know why I knew it, but I knew it. Señor, ¿está usted cansado? We're going again. Yo vivo en México y soy mexicana. Mexicano. Mexicano. Ella es mexicana. Mexicana. Yo vivo en México. Yo estoy bien, estoy. gracias. ¿Y tu esposa cómo estás? Está. ¿Cómo está? Gracias. Hasta 
luego. Alberto es mexicano y Camilla es de Cuba. Él es Él. mexicano y es ella. ella es cubana. Adiós. Hasta luego. Tienes un pecula, pecula favorita. Favorita. Y un sándwich favorito. Favorito. El hombre es de China. That's a good sign. Okay, now, we just did this one, and we messed it up. Do you remember what it was? Is it esta? Estás. Esta? Because it is. Enter. Just kidding. It's not. Señor. Esta. Esta. Usted cantado. Singular. Y tú, Andrea, estás bien? Estás. Not sure why it's like that, but we're going to figure out. El hombre is de China. De China. There's not a man there. It's El. Is El. Is El de China. Is he from China? Easy. Mr. Albert. Señor Albert. Hasta luego. El es de Cuba. Cuando es tu concierto? Soy de Cuba. El concierto es on es en domingo. Sábado, sábado. Domingo must be Sunday. El concierto es el sábado. ¿Cuándo es el partido? No, pecu pe pecula. Pelicula. Pela ¿Cuándo es la pelicula? This is tough. We are, I'm slipping here. I'm slipping. Hold on. ¿Cuándo... Tu cansada. Ocupada. Sofía. Cuando está ocupada. Cuando está ocupada. El estúpido. Estúpido. Yo vivo en México y soy mexicano. Mexicano. Ayo is Mexicana. Mexicana. I don't like using these 10 points or 10 lingots just to not advance. Because I can only do it so many times before I'm out of options. Cuba is interesante. Alberto es de México. Alberto es de México y Camille es de Cuba. Ella is... Él es... Ella. Él es mexicano y Él. Ella, ella es cubana. Adiós. Hasta luego. Estoy hasta luego. Yo estoy bien, gracias. Tú, estoy. Y, ¿Y tu uh, esposa cómo está? Está. Yo estoy bien, gracias. ¿Y tu esposa cómo está? I am good, thank you. How, how about your wife? How is she? How are they? Hasta luego, Señor Torres. I don't know if you hear Ace over there. Ace? Are you okay, little buddy? Sorry, clase. Lo siento, clase. Uh, hola, como estas? And if you haven't been paying attention in these first couple classes, there's still time. But eventually, we're going to get to a point where we only speak in Spanish on this channel. I will call my brother back. Uh, hola, ¿cómo estás? Estás. Yo estoy bien, estoy. gracias. 
Giorgio Soy de China. Tienes un peculiar peculiar favorita, favorita. y un sandwich favorito. favorito. Pelecula. Pelecula. Señor Albert, ¿cómo está? La fiesta es de, divertida. Divertida. And, y el concert es divertido. divertido. The party is fun and the concert is fun. ¿Cuándo es tu concierto? Concierto. Concierto. ¿Tú eres de China? ¿Cuándo es el partido de fútbol? ¿Cuándo es el partido de fútbol? ¿Cuál es Oh, no, cuál is it? Is to Is to Pelecula Favorita? El es, I, I'm the smartest man alive. Um, well, great, now I am just blew it. Is el concierto el miércoles? Martes, el concierto es el martes. Mm. Oh gosh, here we go again. Here we go, Sofia. All right, when are you busy? Tu estas? Cuando está ocupada Sofía? Cuando está ocupada Sofía? I'm getting off. I'm going home. Just kidding. We're home. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. You are home. Shout out to Penny Lane. What are we thinking, guys? Is the concert on Tuesday? What are your thoughts? Let's try and figure it out. Is el is el concierto el martes? Keep doing another. We're gonna hit another one here. Talk about college and describe your family. Just give it a shot. Let's see what we got. What time is it, class? A? Eighteen minutes. We got about ten minutes left. Probably do one or two more. Ella es. Ella es. Ella es. Italiana. Italiana. Y su esposa, él es italiano. Italiano. I have three daughters. What is that, clase? I, yo, that's right, have tango. I have trace hijas. That's a tough one. But it's right. You can just put tango trace hijas. You don't need to put yo like I did. Mi esposa tiene un hermano y una hermana. Mi esposa tiene un hermano y una hermana. They say to know a second language is to have a second soul. So, 
this year I'm going for Spanish. Uh, I'm going to try and mix in a little bit of Japanese. Um, but the languages I'm interested in learning, trying to be like an amateur linguist over here would be Spanish. Um, in, the, in this order too. Spanish, Japanese, and Hebrew are tied. So Spanish up here, Japanese, Hebrew tied, and then French down here. Um, I heard once you know like one language, it's easier to learn more, but obviously we got Spanish going up here. Hebrew, I have some Jewish family members. I'm My father's Jewish, so by, by blood, I am Jewish. It's, it's your birthright, boy. So uh, Judaism for that, uh, Japanese, because I think that Japanese culture and just like the Japanese way of life, there's a lot of overlap with, I guess, like Eastern, Eastern ideologies as far as what they practice in the East and like Eastern medicine and I guess just the way they live their life. So that's why Japanese is up there. But then finally, um, French, which I'm going to learn through Spanish. So I have it set up right now already, but I've done some of the lessons, but you can do it actually on Duolingo. But when you learn a language with another language you've learned, it kind of helps like with more of the immersion aspect. So that's what we got going on over there. A N I E la madre. Su madre, la, not the mother, her mother. Yo no tengo pets. Mascotas. Mi esposa es, estudias francesas. It's just mi esposa. Asturia. Oh, I don't like that sound. I'll tell you that right now. I don't like that sound. Um, let's go back up and hit another number 10. I got it. I got it. I got it. Let's do one more here. Je, how about this? If we can get this one right, we'll end class a few minutes early today. If we can get this. Yo estoy bien, estoy. gracias. Y tu esposa, ¿cómo está? Está. A lot of these are going to be repeats, so it shouldn't be too difficult for us. John es americana. No, 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 no. John es americano. No americana. Americana para José, Josie, uh, la mujer, la mujer está americana, el hombre es americano, Sean, John es americano. Gracias. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Estás. Uh, yo estoy bien, gracias. Estoy. See, and if you guys want to do this as well, you can always upload videos. Um, I'll jump onto your videos as well, watch them, and kind of be like a little, little language learning kind of community in the corner of YouTube. I'm sure there's already some of those existing, but I think they're more like teaching and not necessarily so much like learning. But I'm very much still on the learning side. Yes, I'm very busy. Soy muy ocupado. Tú estás cansado. Estás. Ella está, está. cansada. Hoy es miércoles. Jueves. No, no era. No es. No es. Miércoles. I think that's a Wednesday, actually. Tú. Usted. Okay, I need to know this one. This is one of those ones that's throwing me off every time. Let's just get through this half. Come on. Si hoy es 
wave is. Okay. Oi is Usted. Okay, so I just did this one. So it's me, esta first. E usted está muy ocupado, singular. Usted. Tú no estás ocupado, Bruno. Tú. There we go, thank goodness. All right. ¿Cuándo es el partido? Ella quiere pan. Señor. Tú quieres agua? Es mi computadora. Ella necesita un carro. Él necesita. Él necesito un carro. Mm. Let's go to discuss on this one real fast. Let's see why I got this one wrong. I got a few more minutes left. El necesito un carro. Okay, let's see here. The verb is necesitar. Okay, so I thought necesito would be correct. To use masculine because of the L. The verb is necesita. Our verbs do not change with gender when gender adjectives do. So the conjugation is Jo I O to you as L A nosotros. I might have to come back to that. That's a little tricky. If you know, I guess down in the comments section, you can let me know. But I'm going, I'm going for another. I'm going for it, baby. I'm going for it. We're going for it, baby. We're going for it. Fourth and long, baby. We're going for it. All right. Yo estoy bien, estoy. gracias. ¿Y tu esposa cómo está? Está. Great. Jueves. Viernes. See, I haven't, I haven't done that one in a while, but I still knew. We got uh, about two minutes left. Hola, como estas? Estas. Yo estoy bien, estoy. gracias. Uh, uh, si, sí, el uh, niño es muy feliz. Tu estas cansado. Estas. Está está. El niño es americano. Usted, usted, usted está muy ocupado. Tú no estás ocupado, Bruno. Gracias. Es el americano. Okay, so far so good. Él quiere más pan. El partido no es, no es hoy. El partido no es hoy. I just, I just, 
You heard me say that. Can I get a little half credit, maybe? Es mi computadora. Señor, tú quieres leche? Sí, ella necesita la computadora. I feel it, guys. I feel it. Ella necesita una caro. I bet it's going to be una. No, it's just me, un caro. I knew it, because it's, in that case, the verb, or the word, niña, el niña necesita, or la niña, excuse me, uh, disculpe, la niña, feminine, usa, or necesita, feminine, un caro, caro is not part of, the feminine structuring of that sentence, at least to my understanding. Let me know down below if that's incorrect. All right, we're almost done here. El niño. El niño no necesita. El niño no necesita un carro. El partido no es el, no es el lunes. El no, okay, hold on, almost got it, almost got it, guys. El no necesito más agua. El no necesita más agua. Okay, okay, okay. El partido no es hoy. Okay. El no necesita más agua. Gracias, clase, para su patience. Thank you for being patient, everybody. I appreciate that. We are number three in the ranks. And oh, let me show it over here. Here we go. Boom. As you can see right here, as you can see right here, we are number three in the ranks. Let me pull this up a little. We're getting pretty high up there. Um, number three in the ranks. And I'm thinking within these last couple of weeks, I've gotten almost more experience in my Duolingo tree than I have in quite a while as far as it's like 700 this week. I think I'm only at like 40K total for like 1,800 days. I did the math, or sorry, 1,300 something days. I did the math last week and I was like, basically came up to like 29 experience a day. I'm trying to get like around 150 a day or so, but we'll see how it goes. So we'll switch it over to a Spanish flag or dumpster fire because that's kind of what we were before, but now we're fixing it. But anyway, I appreciate your patience again. I hope you all have a great rest of your Friday. If you enjoyed the video, please consider dropping a like, uh, consider subscribing, as well as dropping a comment down below if you want to participate in the process at all. Um, if you're on Twitch, I appreciate you checking me out over there. Um, this We're going to try and get the video out to more platforms, so whatever platform you're on, I appreciate it, and I hope to see you again in the next one. See you tomorrow. Take care. Stay safe. Hasta luego, clase.